Welcome to GTI Predictive Technology. My name is Tom Honig. Uh, we're going to do a short video here uh, discussing some of the add-ons on channel 2 of our wireless accelerometer. We've done another video. This is what our wireless accelerometer looks like. Uh, it's a two-channel device which we're always developing here. So we're developing new things for the new second channel of this device which we can take a standard accelerometer and we can plug that into channel two and use our phase app um, called phase pro to do phase analysis and things of that nature but what's even even nicer is we've got a tachometer that works with all our balancing apps so what this allows you to do is hook channel two into the tachometer and actually be able to wireless balance something that you may not want to stand next to or something that's uh, running very harshly or you just can't get at it, uh, you know, behind cages and things of that nature. So it's opened new doors. Um, people that are using this new wireless accelerometer for their route, they're able to close machine doors, do things that they could never do before. Uh, one company that is using it for their penthouse on top where all the fans are on the ceiling which they would have to run 100 feet of cable now they can do completely wireless because this works up to 200 feet away directly to the ipad now i wanted to demonstrate i've got a new device hooked up to our wireless device channel 2 and this is some of the development we're doing this is a, a non-contact temperature probe so that converts that analog data point for which is normally used for accelerometer, now converts it for wireless temperature. So wherever this accelerometer is placed, when you're in your route, you're actually clicking one button and you're capturing not only your vibration data, but now you're collecting temperature at all those points. It just gives you more to trend. And as you can see behind me, this automatically trends into Vipro. And it's also used here in Vib RMS. I have in front of me an ice cube and I have in front of me a cup of hot water we poured out of the spigot here. And as you can see, as soon as I hold this up, you'll see in the screen behind me, I get 32.66 uh, degrees on the ice cube, which is very accurate, and I'm getting 131.24 uh, degrees on the hot water. So it's very accurate. All you have to do is put the accelerometer down on a device, and it's already pointing straight down at it, and you'll get your temperature. Um, so these are some of the things that we're developing for Channel 2 as we go wireless. Um, we have many of these out in the field. The, product, the first 100 production units were released uh, about two months ago. Um, people are loving them. So uh, if you would like more information on our wireless accelerometer for iPad, just please reach out to us at www.gtipredictive.com or call us at 603-669-5993. Thank you for your time.